Welcome to our tutorial on quotes. In this video, we'll learn how to create and track quotes in ESC. To create a quote from scratch, go into Sales, Enter Quotes. The Enter Quotes screen is very similar to the Sales Invoicing screen, except that it has a status field directly below the Customer Information section. The status field allows you to mark a quote as Pending, Accepted, or Rejected. If you mark the quote as Rejected, then another field will appear asking for the reason the quote was rejected. The Reason Rejected field is a drop-down menu so that you don't have to manually type the information each time you close a quote. It also makes running a report for rejected quotes easier, as you can filter by the reason the quote was rejected. You'll add billing codes, history codes, and inventory items to the quote screen the same way you add them to a sales invoice, although you may have a couple of extra steps. Unlike the invoice, the cost fields on a quote can be manually updated for inventory items and are not restricted to what has been recorded by the Receive Items screen. You'll also have a markup field that allows you to enter a markup percentage so that you don't have to manually calculate what prices to charge the customer. When you're finished, click the Save button. At this point, you have a pending quote waiting for the customer to accept or reject it. Once the customer decides, you can recall the quote from the Quote List view, the Qualification screen, or just go into the Quote screen, hit the down arrow in the Quote field, and select your quote here. Once the quote is retrieved, you can then change the status to Accepted or Rejected. If the quote is accepted, you can create a dispatch or purchase order from the quote by visiting the Activities menu. The items listed on the quote will be carried to the purchase order, or if you have chosen to create a dispatch, then the items will be carried to the Parts tab of the Dispatch Entry screen. You can also create an invoice from the quote. This is done by selecting the Bill button on the toolbar. Here, you can convert the entire quote to an invoice or make a progressive bill, which we'll be learning about in a later lesson. ESC also provides you with multiple ways of tracking these quotes. You can use the Quote List view by selecting the magnifying glass on the icon toolbar and changing the selected view to Quote List, or you can use the Quote List report from the Sales Reports menu. You'll also notice that in this same menu, you have a report called the Rejected Quote Analysis, which should help you to understand why you are missing out on potential sales. That should be all you need to get started using quotes in ESC. Check out our other tutorials for more information on progressive billing, invoicing, and much more.